Good day, people of God. Welcome to another one. And um, Brother Samuel here from Truths from the Church TV. And um, it's actually concerning. I had to share this. And I believe this video is going to help you and actually make you understand some things about demons and spirits. So a question was asked uh, to Prophet Lovey about um fights in dreams so most people usually see how attacks comes in dreams and stuff like that so prophet lovey had to explain this and i hope this explanation will help you so i don't want to take much of your time i'll just let you watch this video and if you're new to this channel please you want to subscribe leave a like and a comment god bless you okay so uh-huh hmm, i've dealt with a lot I, i'm new to this but i've accelerated so fast that mm. your word has gave me acknowledgement of what i was experiencing we thank the lord jesus huh? yes um so i've experienced multiple types of evil spirits a demon and i don't know if it's because it's my jurisdiction or i don't i don't quite understand what i'm doing wrong okay it's so very simple there are two things that happen to a believer Number one, you need to understand your life is hidden in Christ, in God. What does that mean? If I am indeed in Christ, every battle that comes is coming because God wants me to learn and to grow. You have to always understand that. So if I am getting attacked at night and I'm in Jesus, I haven't done anything wrong. I am trying to live my best my my best life in Christ. I'm doing everything right. It means God is teaching me how to deal with demons. That's how you build muscle. You don't become a warrior by laying around. You become a better fighter by fighting. You become a better marksman by shooting. Whether it's an arrow, no matter what it is. You become better at something because you consistently and continually practice so when god brings challenges to you it's because he's pushing you to grow he's not invoking fear in you because god has not given us the spirit of what fear. no there is no fear in love if there is fear in us it means we have not been perfected by love so what god is trying to teach you is how to deal with spirits the only way they the, the only way the apostles became more powerful is because jesus put them to pray for people so if they were not praying for people they are not getting better is that get, making sense so if you're dealing with attacks god is teaching you to pray god is teaching you not to be afraid god is teaching you to understand you have power over them how do you deal with them now you need to have a godly response to them not a panic response because if i pray one way and it didn't work it means i need to check how did i pray let me look in scripture how was it if a demon attacks me and my prayer is father help me i've missed it when the devil came after jesus jesus never said father help me when the devil came after any man or woman in scripture they didn't cry to god they stood and represented god you understand what i'm saying uh -huh. so you're not doing anything wrong you're being pushed to grow Hallelujah.